Hi, this is Debbie Boyer, and in this video segment, we're going to talk about a really fun app for the classroom, Pick Stitch. Pick Stitch is free for iDevices, and it's also free for Android devices. I'm going to pull down in the middle of the screen, and you can see a picture there of what the Pick Stitch icon will look like. And I'm going to go ahead and click on that, and Pick Stitch will let us choose pictures from the iPhone or the iPad and put them together into one picture collage. You can see that there's a choice of layouts for the pictures, and I'm just going to choose the one that is a 4x4. Four four. When I hold my finger in the first top left-hand square, it says, where would you like to bring in a picture? And I'm going to choose the photo album. And I'm going to choose some pictures that we took on the day that our students were doing their Egypt research project. And this is actually Indiana Jones. And then I'm going to click on the second square in the top right-hand corner and choose the photo album. And we're going to choose our Light View kiddos. And I'm going to size this by taking my fingers and pinching in and out. And then I can also move it around and place it where I want it. Same thing for bottom left. I could also use the camera if I chose to do so. These are our Greenway kids. Pull those in and pinch those up and put them into place. And then one last picture I could take from the camera, but I'm actually going to take the photo album. And we're going to choose a group from Arden Road and put those in place. Now, once I have them there, I can choose to do some frames up at the, the top uh, icon. But some of them cost money, and I'm just going to use the white frame for now. I can use the aspect at the bottom um, edge of the, the photos. And when I do that, it says, do you want to create it into a 4x6 so that I can actually print it out to be a 4x6, say, at Walgreens or Walmart, a 6x4, a 3x4. And so I can choose to do that, or I can leave it at the 1x1 one one, how it is here. I can also click on Resize and resize any of these pictures or replace them. And then when I'm ready, I'm going to click on Export at the bottom right-hand corner of the screen. And it gives me a choice of Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, email. I can take it to uh, send it to Walgreens to print. But I'm just going to choose the photo album, which is stored here on my iPhone. So when I choose the photo album, you're going to see that it's creating an image. And it'll work just a little bit, and then it'll save the image to my photo roll. And then I can email that image out to parents and the principal, anybody you want to share it with. It's also fun for my grandkids and my personal use, but it has great uses in the classroom. They can create an uh, image-based story. They could create images that represent the vocabulary word. Um, math problems they could put on here with one side being the problem and the other side being the answer. Um, they can just do all kinds of things with this in the classroom, and I can't wait to hear how you use it. There's a very similar app, and I'll show you that one right quick. It is called uh, Pick Play Post, and you can see that displayed there. And the only thing, it works exactly the same way, but the only thing about Pick Play Post is it lets you pull in a video clip and add it into the collage so that when you send the collage to someone they can click on it and actually see and hear the video that you insert. So when we click on pick play post you can see it has a similar look to it and when I have the pictures pulled in the top one I'm going to click on and this time I'm going to go to camera roll and videos and I have a picture here that we're going to use from the student showcase and it'll work and work and work a little bit and then post that video right in that top square. It's just kind of a fun way to have uh, visuals along with audio and um, feed to send out to parents. They'll love it. If you have any questions, let me know. Um, pick, pick Play Post is actually $1.99 in the iTunes store. We were able to get it for free for the day on the Canyon ISD iPads, so you'll have that available out on campus. Hope you have a great day.